What is up? I'm at a new creek. I'm going for anything that really bites. It's springtime and hopefully I'm gonna see some fish. The water level is looking really good and yeah, it's just a beautiful spring day. Let's see what we can get. So I've made it to these falls. No way fish are getting up these falls right here. So we're gonna fish downstream, but yeah, it's a nice little waterfall. I like this nice big granite rock right here. Yeah, look at that, bunch of pools. Let's see how it is down here. Bunch of minnows down there. Ooh, something just whacked it. Something not big. All right, let's keep moving. There we go. Oh, I just missed him. Okay, it was small. Looked like a steelhead. Steelhead smolt. Ferns. Mosquitoes are out today. Ooh, we just had a little bit of a bite. Little tut tut tut. Don't think it was a smallmouth though. Across the log. Across the log. This frog. Into the water. There's a fish. Let's go. All right. Oh, he just spit it. I wonder what that was. Oh, he came back. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh, I missed it. There's something that's pretty aggressive right down here. They're biting the tail of it. <laughs> There's one. Oh, he's so, they're so small. All right, that's what we're gonna do. We gotta switch it up. All right, we're going old school. We're digging up some worms. This would be the perfect worm. We're going micro fishing style. I got a small little hook on there. We're gonna put the worm on and we're gonna see what we can get. Let's see what these fish are. There we go, there's one. <laughs> First cast. Ah, oh, the good old bluegill. First bluegill of the year for me. Oh, he flopped right off. Okay. They can't resist the worm. Let's see if we can get another one. There's one. Yep. <laughs> Look at that. Another bluegill. Almost identical to the other one. Kind of drab looking one. Pretty though. Nice pretty little fish. All right, so we knew that they're probably bluegill. Oh, I just had another little bite. Ah, it stole my worm. I don't know if that's gonna be enough. Found a spot, do a little digging. Might have to get a little bit deep on it a little bit. And there you go, there's your worm. There's one. Oh, that's a really pretty one. That is not a bluegill either. That's like a hybrid. It's like a pumpkin seed bluegill hybrid it looks like still a really pretty one look at that fish still a pretty fish all right see you bud oh i just had a little bite oops just another little bite a little bite oh he came right here look at this you just go right here and just probably drop it right down and boop got it <laughs> there we go there's another bluegill Ah, oh, that's awesome. This is how you catch a fish in five seconds. Yep, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Another little bluegill. Oh my gosh, they're so loaded in here. There's one. Oh, it's a nicer one. It's <laughs> a nicer little bluegill. All right. This worm is kind of going at the end of its life, but oh, cookie cutter size bluegill. I'll top you back in there. There's one. Gosh, there's a lot of bluegill right in here. Well, I definitely know my bluegill spot. If we had to get a bluegill spot. There we go, there's a nice little worm. There's one. Ooh, this might be the bluegill of the day. Oh yeah. Bluegill of the day. Gorgeous looking fish. Really pretty. There, there it is. Another bluegill. 
Oh, look at that. Bluegill, bluegill, bluegill. Really pale. So a lot of times fish get that pale color when they're in that drab water. If this is a little clear water, they'd probably be col colored up a little bit better, but there he is. Oh, what a pretty one. Now that is the prettiest fish of the day. Oh, he flopped off. I wanted to show you more of them. That was a really pretty sunfish. Yeah, so the rig I'm doing, a couple split shots and just a hook and a worm. It's like the age old rig. It catches just about everything, especially bluegill. Oh, look at this mosquito full of blood. And there's a fish on. Oh, this one's feisty. All right, bluegill. Ooh, one of the bigger ones of the day. Nice. See you, bluegill. There's one. Nice. Oh my gosh. The bluegill are biting. Oh, I love these fish. They're just so fun when you're, fishing's not maybe going your, your way. You can catch a bunch of little bluegill and have yourself a little bit of day. Something about just tugging on the line, it just makes it fun. There's one. There are so many bluegill stacked up there. I mean, this is the bluegill, bluegill haven. There's one. I'm kind of hoping for something to be different, but they're all pretty much the same. All right, we're gonna keep moving on. These ones, that's that stinging nettle, and that will destroy you. So if you see really prickly plants like that when you're walking through the woods, especially next to a river, that stinging nettle will mess you up. That's got me a couple times. These ferns are fine, that stinging nettle, no good. So try to avoid that as best as you can. I know it comes out of nowhere. There's another bunch. This is kind of loaded with it, so I'm trying to not get stung because it is rough and it's just so piercing. Yeah, I definitely, oh, I got it on my foot. And it just itches and it stings and it's no fun. There's one. Oh my gosh. Okay, so small bluegills. That's the name of the game in this little hole. Fun to still catch a fish, but wow, they're small. Let's keep moving. Ooh, there's one. Floppy, floppy one. Oh my gosh, it's a yellow perch. What? There's yellow perch in here? I did not expect that. A yellow perch. Really pretty fins on it. Wow. This little hole, little creek. See you later, yellow perch. I just lifted this rock and there is four redback salamanders underneath it. That was pretty cool. Look at all these. And these almost have like different color coloration variations. So some of them are a little bit darker. Some of them are a little bit redder, um, but all redback salamanders. So we'll put them back underneath the rock. See you later, guys. Let's see if there's something maybe underneath this one. Oh my gosh, there's another one. Another redback. Gorgeous little guy. Really pretty. There we go. A little fish of some sorts. And it looks like a creek chub. And that's what it is, a creek chub. There it is. I better get this one. There we go. That is a trout right there. Let's go. That's a nice, nice looking smolt. I mean, that's a big smolt. It looks like a stalker fit. Yeah, it's definitely a, probably a stocky, stalker rainbow. But nice looking smolt, smolt size. I'm glad we finally got him. Oh, there you are. Dude, I was uh, recording. Look at little stalker. There we go. What is this? It's like another creek chub. Actually, it's like a, it's not a creek chub. It's like a shiner of some sort. Whoa. I mean, dude, it's just like nonstop in these little corners. Bluegill saved the day. It's a frog, green frog. Oh, missed it. He's gonna wanna jump this way. 
Oh, he's on my foot. Got him. Oh, he snuck out. Ah, oh, missed him. Check out this guy. This big old toad. I mean, that thing's a honker. Wow. It's probably gonna pee on me, but wow, look at that toad. Whoa, dude. Look at that. Oh, he's jumpy. Eric, come here, buddy. I mean, that thing's a tank of a toad. Not 100% sure the exact species, but very cool little toad. You never know what you're gonna find in the woods. It's the beautiful thing about doing it. Kind of in the wetland forest. It's all pretty sloppy frog water. Oh, whoa. I think it was just a bunch of fish. Yeah, look at all these fish. There are a ton of fish up in here. We're making it to the mouth. It's all just a swamp in here. A little marshy area. Mouth of the river. Ooh, there's a fish. Nice. Is that largey? Oh, large mouth. Right. In these reeds right here. That's pretty cool. Look at that little large mouth. Right here on the reeds. Gorgeous. I'll take a little large mouth. That's fun. It's a little deep. A little sloppy. There we go. It's a little bit higher around. Give me my, give me my lure back. It's a huge beaver. There's a huge beaver like right here. <laughs> it swam like right in front of me. <laughs> it scared the crap out of me, dude. This little map turtle. Do I just call it a little map turtle? Look at this little guy, little map turtle. See you, Matt Turtle. Fish on? Fish on. Let's go, dude. A uh, largey? Oh, dude, that's a that's a pretty nice largey, dude. Let's go, dude. Inhaled it. All right, let's get it for the let's get it for the thing. Pop the hook out. Oh. Look at that. Fish. Luke's first appearance on the YouTube. Nice little largey. Beautiful fish. Here, let's go like that. What do you think? Two pounds, two and a half? Uh, I'd say it's probably three, dude. It's chunky. Three? Yeah. It's fat. Real, real fat. Not All right, I'm going to hold the line low so that you can get your hands on it. And then... Okay. How's the water? <laughs> it's pretty cold, actually. You got braid. Yeah, this is braid. Yeah, it kind of comes up. It's wow, it's real shallow over here. Ooh, yeah, you were, dude, you were stuck. There we go. All right, ready? So this side is definitely the deep side. Side stroke. Yeah, I can't touch bottom here, dude. This is a deep channel. There, who knows what's in there? All right, just went for a dip. Fishing with my buddy, Luke. Luke got some, what'd you get? Large mouth and? Two large mouth, some other big bites. One of them was a big walleye that I lost. Big and walleye. something that pulled a bunch of drag. Didn't get a look at it. Uh, but I am sad I missed it. But that's okay because caught some fish. Had a nice time. Absolutely. Caught a nice little diversity of species. But yeah, I didn't get any of the smallmouth that we were kind of looking for. But it's all good. Still had a fun day. Beautiful mm. sunset. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you next time. Only got two though. Well... <laughs> Check that out. We got a leech. Oh, yeah. That thing has been sucking on me. That thing's full of my blood. That's pretty sick. <laughs> <laughs> I should put it on as bait. Look at this one, dude. This one's sucking on... This one's, like, making me draw blood. 
a little bit of leech action. That's what happens when you get in the... Look at dude, the... See all that blood? It's... Yeah, it's brutal. <laughs> no one makes me bleed my own blood. <laughs> wow. I mean, look at that. It just will not stop bleeding. <laughs> it's pretty nasty. Watch out for leeches, everybody. They're gonna get you bloody.